Welcome to today's Knowledge Nugget. During this episode, we will dive in and explore the most essential information surrounding spirometry. In detail, the content of this video will cover the broader definition of spirometry, categorization into different test types, and the most relevant practices and applications of spirometry. During spirometric examination, the breath of the subject travels from a special fit mouthpiece into the so-called spirometer or measuring device. This process is performed under resting conditions or in combination with a CPT. The outcome of the measurement gives us information about the respiratory capacity and flow of the lungs. In other words, it assesses how well the lungs function by measuring how much air a person can inhale or exhale in combination with the speed and force rate of those movements. The main maneuvers of spirometry are listed on this table, starting off with a vital capacity test which is mostly used on patients with respiratory limitations where no forcing of the breathing maneuver is required. On the contrary, the forced vital capacity requires maximum effort from the subject during exhalation. And lastly, the maximum voluntary ventilation demands the subject to breathe in and out as much and as fast as possible for 15 seconds. By conducting these maneuvers, the clinicians or sport physicians can diagnose a series of chronic lung conditions. Here we see a graphical representation of the forced vital capacity on the performance of static lung volumes. This respiratory curve can later on be combined with the respiratory recordings during a stress test, the so-called exercise flow volume loops, thus providing us a conclusive picture on the dynamics of respiration under stress. By observing the ventilation curve for any disturbances of the loop, we could potentially diagnose stress-induced asthma. To conclude, spirometry is a diagnostic approach to assess and identify limitations of the lungs. It can either take place during a resting state or be implemented within an exercise condition. Spirometry is also used to confirm if a specific therapy or treatment has a positive effect on the breathing condition. Thank you for joining.